As we grow up, we all depend on the wisdom of our parents, family, and friends to support us. But as we mature, we're often are helped by people that not only believe in an idea, but believe in each of us. When Jim and I decided we want to build that first boat, we had the desire, we had the passion for it, and we had enough skill that we thought we could get away with it. But we didn't have the resources. Over the years, we'd met Gene Vogler and Bucky Dennis, guys who shared a passion for Harker's Island and Carter County and offshore sport fishing. They were both very successful businessmen in their own right, and they believed in what we thought we could accomplish. And I remember driving up to Mr. Dennis's place of business where we're all going to meet. You know, I tell you, I was a nervous guy. We'd never build a boat, and we've got to go talk to these guys about, about helping us with the money to build the very first one. We could have been a disaster for us. There may never have been a first boat. But just his attitude, his seeing something in us maybe that we never had seen in ourselves, that belief in us helped us go forward and helped us build that first boat. Another local charter guy that believed in us was a guy named Ben Green who ran a boat called Bill Collector. Just as we were about to move from Wilson to Marshallburg, we didn't have a boat to build. And to be honest, we were questioning if we should even move. But Ben Green came down and took a chance on us, and for $109,650, we agreed to build the Bill Collector, which is still fishing today on the Morgan City waterfront. When you build a custom boat, you have to really believe in the person you're hired to do it. I mean, just think about it. You come into our place of business, and we show you a sheet of paper and a pile of wood and tell you that's going to be your boat one day. Now, I'm telling you, that's trust. That's believing in somebody. Everyone we ever built a boat for became part of our family. And everyone who owns one of our boats today is part of our family. A lot of customers stand out in my mind. When I sit here today, I think about Dr. Bob Barada. I think about Dr. Johnny Kagan and Dr. Jerry Coates, Carol Thomas, Jeff Burton and Curtis Strange, Donald Barefoot, who built the first coal molded boat, Craig Linder, who we never even met, his first real professional captain we probably ever built a boat for here, Rob Gallahan who made us push our limits on his boat and paint it a color we never would have believed. The pools who have campaigned the waste knot all over the world. All these people had one thing in common. They believed in us and they believed in the future of our company. And they'll always be part of our family. 35 years ago when we met with Gene and Bucky, they just didn't help a business get started. They didn't help us just build our first boat. They showed me how much difference one person can make in the life of another. Making me a better person, and reminded me that dreams can become a reality. Through the entire history of our company, every single boat has been different. It's had its own signature. It's had its own challenges. It's taught us something. I mean, no boat we ever built didn't make us better. 